failed your mission miserably. Peter Quill, these lackluster bounty hunters claim Lady Hellbender hired them to kill us. Hey, we're no slouches. We're part of the League now. No, no, no. You said yourself she'd hunt us to the end of the universe. I had hoped she'd send a monster, not these two. We would have murderized you. But don't worry, there's more coming. Did you hear that, Peter Quill? A silver lining. Yeah, that's great, Drax. Won't be long in these clabber traps. Not us. Mm -mm. Print, hey, this print, is a big uh, mistake. Uh, I'm innocent. Real soon. Cosmo, you are you out there? Cosmo! Be silent. Nice that you finally showed up. Would have been even nicer if you didn't abandon me in the first place. I never left. One minute, we're having a great time, and the next... Wait a second, did you use me as bait? Huh. Well, your plan worked a little too well, seeing how we're in jail now. We're all in prisons of our own making, Peter. Break lady ain't gonna get us out of here, then. I reckon. Hello? Cosmo? I really need to use the bathroom. I'm good. Yeah, get your mitts off of him. Ow! I'm not better to scratch me! Oh, I'll do more than that. I'll murderize you. Uh, <laughs> hey, guys. Didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, cram it, Flatnard. Flatnard? Yeah, and a scruff crew in one, too. Shut up and get in there. <laughs> Come on, dude. What's your problem? You are. That's why we quit. <laughs> yes, you did. Now stop talking to him! Rocket, buddy, come on. We had a good thing going. You and Groot are better than two-bit bounty hunters. Scoff. What did you say? I said scoff. You don't say scoff, you just scoff. Oh, so now I don't express myself proper-like? <sighs> you know what? You're a real piece of... Rocket, dude, woof. We should have left you in when we buffed the chance. <laughs> like, where we are. You don't, woof, woof, woof. What? You rough in front of me? I told you a bajillion times, I'm not a roughing animal! What were you talking about? You rough this? Where are we? You would have been still on Norway. Osmo! How you doing, buddy? We were just about... <laughs> Guardian of Galaxies will tell Cosmo why they broke into Continuum Cortex. Or Cosmo will conjure worse psychic gulag. Broke into the... Do not feed Cosmo Cat Biscuit's Peter Quill. You work with Blood Brothers. Create distraction, so pesky raccoon and sentient tree friend can use Continuum Cortex. Cosmo also know Guardian of Galaxies have Nova Tracker on ship. Okay, I'm sure it's just one big misunderstanding. Right? Right. We're here because something happened on the... No Guardian of Galaxy, we're on Nova Rock. Yeah, we went to find Centurion Corral and pay our fine. Why? Strange transmissions spreading across galaxy. Like rabbits in springtime. Cosmo sent many team to investigate, none return. Now Nova Rock sending same signal. Guardian of Galaxy will tell me what they saw. The Nova Corps were killing each other. 
It was like they were drinking funky juice or something. Or joined the cult. Yeah, during that ritual with the priest. They kept talking about a promise. <laughs> Fraternity and Raptors. Cult of the Negative Sounds. Universal Church. Whoa, 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 stop! <laughs> that's them. That old man that's with them. His shuttle exploded on the Hallis Hope. Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Universal Church of Truths. That name ring bells, Cosmo. His old cult. Very powerful during Galactic War. Now. Not so much. You said the rock was transmitting a signal. What if the religion were somehow... And yet, the Universal Church of Truths died with Goldskin God. Let us investigate the Hallow's Hope for you. <gasps> what? You said none of your teams returned, right? Seems to me like you're short-staffed, and we want to find out what happened as much as you do. We do? So let us investigate for you. Always a catch, Peter Quill. And not, not fun, fun kind with ball. Ball. <laughs> what Guardian of Galaxies want in return? Simple. Drop the charges. Contact Nova Corps HQ and get the world mind to forgive our fine. Then we'll go. It's not being so easy. <clears throat> Face it, dog breath. You need us. Us? For now. Unless you got someone else stupid enough to go. Soviet Russia, Cosmo would not trust words of capitalist scum. But this is not motherland. And Cosmo no power of collateral. Guardian ship, stay on nowhere. What? You can't take our ship? My ship. How are we gonna find the Hallow's Hope? Ask Pesky Raccoon. Now come, essences of time. Exactly. To original settlement. From early days. Before Tivan group come. You mean the first mining colony is still here? Duh. Now abandoned. Mostly. And highly restored. Uh. This is the place you broke into. Broke implies it took effort. Wait, this is the Continuum Cortex? It's the best way to reach Nova ship before it moves again. We found Corel. Where is she? Nova ship currently in the leader system, orbiting Michael planet. Contraxia. Cosmo not surprised. Pesky Raccoon enjoy garbage planet. Their restrooms do provide valuable information. Entire planet now broadcasts same signal as Nova Rock. Cosmo not understand purpose or intention. All them bars and betting parlors and brothels. Maybe it's not such a bad thing after all. We can find Corel and save Contraxia. Maybe we shouldn't make too many guarantees. We're the guardians of the galaxy. This is what we do. I am with you, Peter Quill. You are? Of course. It was a rousing speech. Bootlicker. How many people know about this place? Enough. It's not broadcast across galaxy, but scientists come from many backgrounds. If Thanos had known this was here... Ah, dead. So, what is this? Like another elevator? They'll figure it out. Please to stand back, Guardian of Galaxies. Oh, what magnificent witchcraft is this? I know. It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please to step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo, and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. His time. 
Investigate Novish. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Those won't do the best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw up this time. Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I am broke. You get used to it. Are we in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between realities even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever with this thing. Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. It's incredible. Oh. Avengers! Assemble! What kind of name is Avengers? Is that sound normal? <laughs> normal? You ain't heard nothing yet. Oh, Pat Benter and John Jet watch over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. <laughs> uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It's obviously an ill omen of our impending deaths. No matter where you hide. I will fight. No. Or it's an alternate reality. <laughs> I know that sound. I am proud. Definitely an alternate reality. <laughs> hey, look! It's Spider Man! Wait, is that Earth? Mom? Come on, you're deep for the promise here. Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay. Next stop, Alice Hope. Probably. Hold on, Groot. Here we go. <gasps> Clark and Alice! Clark and breath! Okay, here we go! Whoa, Whoa no, Clark! Direct. You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scott Lord both ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. Nothing's happening! Gamora, tell him to check the power supply. It's empty! Then tell him to find a battery. Did you catch that? Yeah, yeah. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? Both are undeniable clues. Uh, someone tell him what he's looking for. Peter Quill, you are supposed to be looking for something. A battery! So we can get the lousy gravity going. you doing in the cortex coming back from a job a successful one why come back to nowhere at all I mean if you really wanted to quit the uh, the, the client was there nope useless storm drain find a battery yet we are still floating so no might be just what we need okay got us a battery took him long enough Hey, I'm trying, man! And we're still floating around! The Global Danger Mission. Cosmos. Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening! Seriously? Uh, fine, I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath! Tell me what you see! Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay. Okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain surgery. Just pick one. I have begun. Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! Everybody! 
Gravity was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what. <sighs> Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? The day I was kidnapped. When my mom died. We should continue our investigation for the dog. We'll need to get this wreckage out of the way first. Roots right. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we found so far? What do you mean a code word? Fine. Brood won't call the mud until we all agree on a code word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? Ooh, oh! The code word is Ride the Stars. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. This is the only way out, but the door's got no juice. Must be on a different circuit. Can't you transfer power to it? I'm not the one with the zappy guns. That'll do it. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. All the blaster scorch marks are from standard ish Nova rifles. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova pass? Nikki gave it to me. To keep it away from her mom. We can sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? What do you hope to find here, Peter Quill? Nikki had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. You are fond of this girl. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay. I wonder if they'll find anything. Like a way to turn the power back on. Or some kind of hint to what happened. Why does that keep happening? There, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. Knew this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me, to keep it away from her mom. 
We could sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Novacore does to people who steal from them? Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? What do you hope to find here, Peter Quill? I think we had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. Fond of this girl. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay. Oh, no. Please don't. Do you know this maintenance worker, Peter Quill? No. So you believed? I am. What the flark are you two doing? Let's go already! Way. Drax's his rap sheet. He's got to see this. Now we're exploring maintenance tunnels. It can't hurt, can it? Better we check than miss something. This place don't look too safe, is all. Still nothing but emergency power. Dog report item. Power outage in several sections of the ship. What are we missing? Let's run through it all. We got arrested by your girlfriend. As did the churchman Grand Unifier Raker, and then his ship exploded. So maybe that's where it started. Raker might have had something on his ship. A gas, maybe? Wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. Anova never really let me out of their sight. They had good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you was accurate. Here's the deal. We figure out what is going on here, and then we can figure out how to work better together. So, just ignore the obvious while it's inconvenient? Yes. First thing we do when we get back on the Milano is have a big talk. Pinky swear. That is the weakest of the digits. No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa, ho, ho. look at you, you sexy beast. Ah, uh, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Eh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. Makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. Eh, uh, we can use this to re-invert the core. Or, uh, uh de-invert. Uh, de de-vert? Rocket. Yeah, the console safety lock because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost! Of course! It is time. Here it comes. Uh, Peter Quill's mask to guide us with its mysterious power. Ain't nothing mysterious about it. Definitely something up here. Hell yeah, it worked! You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. All right, Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. That did it. Get back down here. Well, stop larking around. It ain't gonna work without the arms. Now, let's see what we... Guys, we've got incoming. Yeah, it's more of them infected freaks. Man, I was hoping we'd find Nova Corps here, but not like this. Now we know who inverted the core. But why? Hold him down, Groot! Smash him, Gamora! He's trying to gun fight the reactor core! Ah! If it explodes, at least our opponents will perish with us! Stupid Nova Armor! Remind me to sharpen my blade! I think we're all gonna need some repair! 
repairs after this! Definitely not the Nova Corps I was hoping to find here! No, but they're exactly who I expected! This is Nova Corps! They can't hold us responsible! Please! What this cosmos send us into? Let's just get it done! My great strength goes underutilized! Time's up! What's next, Peter? I will end you! His insanity has been silenced! I look forward to our next encounter! Did you notice the rumbling stuff when we flipped the reactor away from the ceiling? We must find a way up there and discover why, for the dog report. Rocket, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the honors. Okay... Surprise! This whole thing's a lift! We can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova Grunts and Grease Monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta make... Whoa! Clark! Clarky Clamps! You're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Clarkers de-re-inverted the core again! We'll just have to re de re it back! After we take some head! Go struggle in pain! When possible, circumvent electrical hazard. Guys, huddle up! Why'd you call us in, Peter? I, for one, am doing great out there. As am I, assassin. So perhaps he wants you out of my way. Or maybe he wants you to sit back and watch so you can learn from a pro. Dudes, relax. We need to have each other's backs out there. No one's winning this on their own. Precisely. But if we stay united and centered, there will be no turning back. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter. Can't Grimm. wait to take him down. Oh, yeah. Those lines are starting to kick me off. Tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time, we've got a control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Duh! Sneaky dash bags. They scrambled the power circuit, so I can't release them. I'm tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? You should see power grids along the walls around here. Find their powered up nodes. Looking for glowy power nodes. Right. When you find them, you need to electrify the junction switch in the direction you want the power to flow. 
Shoot them with electricity? Yeah, we're aiming for big, glowing lines routing back towards the clamps in the middle. Looks like the wall's weak here. Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. And you will have one. Everybody stay alert. Will has a knack for pushing the wrong buttons or crossing the wrong wires. The small hairy one is insinuating you are bad luck. Funny how the small hairy one is always right there guiding me. Peter Quill is insinuating that you, Weasel, could be the cause of our problems. Uh, hurry it up, Quill. Lumpy's bugging everybody with his color commentary. You know, normally, you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a decompression on the other side. Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a Groot Root Boost thing. He's eager to drive the Groot Boost. Neat trick. Groot loves being helpful. He's always helpful. Hoist that up, Groot. Is there any chance of Quill getting back together with Lady Love? <laughs> She's no lady. She never set her standards that low anyway. That's factually untrue. Did that do anything? I see it now. You've got half of it rerouted. Now work on the other room. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that! Perhaps the Nova Killer knows how to redirect these machines. She has experience. Got a locked door. Can you open it? No. Can you route power to it? Not from here. I'll try to find a way around. Possible. They try to recruit Corman from any world in good standing. Well, too bad. Root's the last one, and he's too smart to ever sign up with them scuttles. I mean, that sounds great and all, but we usually fail at our missions. Not this time. Our work here is important. Groot! Need your help, buddy! Root boost, please! I'm Groot! Thereabouts! Perhaps they are recharging their personal devices. Their what? Their electronic tablets and assorted communication gadgetry. And do you think they would need power from the ship's core for that? Okay! I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here! Solid plan! Hell yeah! Who's smarter than Nova Core? Huh. What did that open? Cosmo didn't fetch a bunch of his muscle and do this himself. It is simple. It required professionals. Yeah, the poocher don't even need to lift a pot and take down Lady Alvender's invincible goons needs us. That's gotta be one of the power nodes, just need to reroute it. Well, I think you had it right the first time.
Looks like you did it, Star Pants. Now get into the control room and hit that clamp release. I'll re reinvert the core at the same time and get us moving again. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. Clamps are unclamped. Slick. Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. This would go a lot faster if we all had the ability to scan. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. All right, this is our floor. These doors are sealed tight. Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Oh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up there. Great. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scud! What are these Franklin Gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know! Looks like it's siphoning something! Something to do with those cubes? Don't know! I gotta get a closer look! Peter Quill, we have been in this hangar before! It's like they're stalking up on something! Quill would never have allowed this to happen to her ship! So, you think she escaped? I don't know! Could be holed up in her office. So what is it? I think they're using the ray to fill some kind of battery. Standard galactic I.O. ports, regalian glass mat separators, free cathodes. I understood some of those words. I ain't never seen nothing like it. This is where the churchman's shuttle exploded. Yeah, well, it looks a little different now. Because of the giant machine, yes. But I assure you, Peter Quill, this is where you and the girl almost fell to your deaths. What the? Flark! Frog report item. Scott, that's loud! Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from the tracks. Don't forget the energy cubes. Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. Groot! We need to check out that giant ray thing! Can you get us across? I'm Groot. Dog report item! We gotta destroy this thing! We don't even know what it is! Plus, we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship! <laughs> Let's avoid the scary beam! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo Jackie. Investigation lead him to believe Halaho is key to Galaxy Mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Ah, flark the report. Tell him his magic hand almost got us killed. Contraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is... Uh-oh. What is... Uh-oh. Piotr Quinn. Something just came up. We'll call you back. Your experience fighting Centurions will be necessary here, woman. Spread out! Shoot Turn the ball! Make your maker! Uh, we're too far gone to talk to! Aim for their torso! They're too flarking fidgeting! Throw that trash! Divide and 
Scott! How do we fight a flying enemy? I'd have hoped the Centurions would have resisted whatever this is! Feel this! And on the ground as well! Take heed! Sick of tracks! Die with honor! Precision is key here, guys! My plan is to blast them! get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Huh. That ain't right. Drax, gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. All plans need steps to succeed. Ugh. What new age drivel have you been reading? We need to stop the batteries from moving, Peter. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? Anything to get out of here. We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. I've done my part. Yeah, thanks. We still need a way through! Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. Just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not stick around to find out. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. You think that the unifier has detected an intrusion? Spread out. It will be contained by, by her, her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail times. It was adorable. I hate you all. Okay, group. I think I know my way around. We just need to get into the tunnels on the other side there. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! piece of the Uniflyer's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. How is that not the same? Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. 
Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. One more time, Groot. Let's go find Corel and Nikki. So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corel survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. Nikki's one of the most resourceful kids I ever met, and Corel's a warrior. I'd bet on both of them any day of the week. Okay, just don't forget who won. Whoa, watch out! You okay? Groot says we should start thinking about exit plans. The exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Answers you need, maybe. Don't suppose you've seen Nikki? I'm sorry, what? You feeling okay, Peter? It's one of Nikki's robots. She gives them names and takes care of them or whatever. Does not look taken care of to me. Does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. I am <sighs> Of course you would. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. There, breezy peasy. Ah, uh, more death gas. Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and hear me out on this, maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Oh, can you both please just get over this? Agreed. Either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Hey, I ain't the one who keeps sabotaging this team. You're the one who quit! Out of frustration with Quill's lack of fleeting-like qualities. See, even now he ain't owing up to anything. In Katathian culture, silence is the ultimate form of contrition. Yeah, and Peter's never been quiet this long, so clearly this is his apology. Fine, whatever. Are you sure this is the right way, Peter Quill? It's clearly not. I'm investigating. Here. This is definitely the right way. These markings suggest otherwise. Exactly. Need your help, Drax. I will not. Rocket, buddy! Come on, Pete. Give it a slice, Gamora. I was in the mood to cut something. <laughs> you sure this is the right way? Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter. If Nikki and Corel really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not.
Did you find a dog report item? No, nothing dog report worthy. Still no signs of Nikki or Corral. In the face of death's infinite mystery, Contathians are taught to focus on what is tangible. I'll keep that in mind. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are, right after we check here. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter! The... the pirate? Nikki! We do not intend to kill you. We need to get into that room. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. Oh. Rocket, you got the body of a little girl. Can you fit in there? Try again, Quill. Ask him nicely, Peter. I'm concerned for Nikki's safety, okay? I'm worried she might be hurt or scared or... I don't know what. Can you please see if she's in there? See? Was that so hard? I don't see no kid. <sighs> Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming her stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait Is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve. And Quill was with the child's mother. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. It's not like they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. I think he's still... For all we know, maybe this guy's her dad. Yeesh. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. Got you covered. Okay. Where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. Should be a way to Corell's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> Guys, could we not make light of all this? We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Yes, she should have exhibited at least some foolishness. Maybe it's a trait that kicks in later. Okay, Drax is clearly on to something, so let's all just go with that. That Nikki is too smart to be your daughter. Whatever it takes to get out of this. You're really gonna be one of those dads? No, that's not what I... 
That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? I know, I, I just... We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corel's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. Next stop, Corel's office. Dog report item. We are lost. Come on. Just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's gotta be eaten at you. None of this changes who I am. I'm still cool as a cucumber. Groot says all the cucumbers he's ever met were terrified on the inside. Well, that don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. We don't know who won. Pretty sure I know. Hello? Corel? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. Or there are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer. See if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Return, hope, promise. The resemblance is uncanny. She doesn't look anything like me. She's blue. Besides, why wouldn't Corel have just told me? Protect her daughter, Peter. Copulating with you was a capital offense under the Kree purity laws. That's not a real thing, is it? The Kree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. So, when Corel said we shouldn't be doing this... It was being literal. Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. What's the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. Well, this is fancy. For valiant heroism against unrelenting tyranny. That's the highest commendation given out by the Kree. How come I never got one of these? I did heroic stuff. You're not a Kree. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. Ah, oh, appealing. Any luck getting in? The thing's pretty well protected. I need time. All right, let me know. Don't worry, Corral. I'll make sure this gets back to you. Are you seriously focused on food right now? Mystery makes me hungry. Hey, save me some, will ya? I wonder if Nikki made this. I am Groot.
What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree purity laws. From a legal perspective, copulating with you is extremely objectionable. From other perspectives, too. This does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Kree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity is encrypted. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging from a wall. Okay, I'm in! But I got bad news, lover boy! What did you find? Come here and I'll show you! So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. It means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Okay, so looks like the church is behind the- Oh, crap! Uh, nuts to this! I'm out of here! Stop! Tell the dog about the priest. Ro Tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest. I am Groot. Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. I am Groot. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. So according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Come on! <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. Encountered a formidable new enemy, but still no sign of ghosts. You mean literal ghosts? The ghosts in the system. Remnants of data. Yeah, let it go. Just let them think there are ghosts.
Man, what I would give to get into some of these servers. I thought that was the plan. There's an open panel up in the corner there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we just gotta jump across a few of these floaty server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. It's weird, right? Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the Nexus control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. That does not seem like you. He probably thinks the Nexus is booby-trapped. Ah, that would explain it. Have you found any useful information, Peter Quill? Uh, well, it's something. What are we waiting for? <laughs> nice. That's quite the mustache. Find something? So Corel's badge number is 0001. How could she be the first one? The World Mind reset all Nova IDs after the Galactic War. I do not understand. Why is Peter Quill not accessing the Nexus? Because he's scared of ghosts. Liar! Uh, Groot wants to know if Quill's stalling because of his fear of parental responsibility. Obviously. Find something? Just some personal logs. Huh. I wonder. Dog report item. We have reached the command center, but Peter Quill refuses to access the Nexus. What do you think, Groot? He says it's the best. Rocket, just access it yourself. Mm -mm. Regular computers are one thing, but I ain't leaving my prints on no Nexus terminal. Locked. I wonder though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next. We're in. You're kidding. Well, yes. Guys, we're in. Go to the criminal records, Quill. I want to see my files. Twenty units. Mine's the biggest. I've heard of this guy. I thought there'd be more here. Read it and weep, losers. There ain't a single scam me and Groot haven't pulled off. I am unfamiliar with this Kree. One of the nameless. Get to the juicy stuff already. Alright, let's take a look. I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocols. Got a... Hey, isn't that... The mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. When's the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral! Found something. After we left. Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. <laughs> no, you're a lotus scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. That gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? 
Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices yeah. must be I had to check. Groot, right the stars. <sighs> Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. Matriarch awaits. 